game changers. What you do every single day, the service that you put in every single day is changing more lives than you know. That's probably the most frustrating thing about being an educator is you sacrifice and you give so much to these kids, but many of them, when they leave your school or they leave and go to the next grade, you don't get to see them five years later. You don't get to see them when they graduate from high school or when they get accepted to college or when they get married or when they have their first child. I wish so bad that I could find those teachers, those few teachers who saw something special inside me when everyone else wrote me off. Man, if I could just find those few teachers and say, thank you, look at me now. I, I own a home, I've got a few businesses, a nonprofit, I've written a bunch of books, I've got a bunch of degrees because of you. But they're not here, and I can't find them. But I can tell you, because of the sacrifice that you make every single day coming to this school, because of teachers and educators and administrators like you that speak life because of people like you, our country has a fighting chance. This new generation has a fighting chance. And these kids are going to go to a whole another level. But that can only take place when we live a life of service, when we live lives of making solutions, and we live lives of sacrifice. You know, one of the number one messages I share when I go to schools, and I'll be honest with you, Nowadays, when the school calls me and they're like, man, we want you to come and speak to our kids. I don't mind speaking to the kids, but more than anything, I want to speak to the teachers, the staff. Because if I can put this thing inside you, you now can give it to the kids and continue to reinforce it. So when I sit down now with the, with the teachers, I do what I do with them. And when I get with the kids, you know what the number one thing I tell them is? Is that your teachers are human, just like you. Think about it. You can get diagnosed with something. You get that phone call. You're dealing with financial strains. I know because you overworked and you underpaid. You got, you got marital issues within your home. You suffer from depression, but you come to school every single day and you say, I'm going to leave this in my car because I've got to give my best to these kids. That's what next level teaching is. That's that next level education right there. And you can only do that if you if you every single day you say, you know what, I'm going to sacrifice me for these kids.